Today's video is going to show you how to play coverage defense in Madden NFL 16. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I like to make Madden 16 videos, post them on the internet. Today we are taking a look at the big nickel bear formation, something we've been looking at all week long. And uh, what I want to do is uh, talk today from the concept of coverage defense. We've shown you how to get pressure uh, from the, you know, from man coverage and zone coverage. And now we're going to show you how to create a really good coverage defense uh, from this package. And what play we like to use here uh, is the middle plug two, uh, but you could use other plays, uh, of course, but we really like the middle plug two. All right, so what you want to do with the middle plug two to create a nice coverage defense is you want to go ahead and make the sa similar setups to what we've done before. You want to base the line, you want to uh, press coverage, spread your defensive line, pinch your linebackers. Okay, then you see this is going to create this nice basic front for you. What I like to do from this point is take my middle linebacker and place him into a deep blue zone. And then I like to take Huff here. He's a... Uh, He's kind of an option. You can do whatever you want. You can man him up if there was a slot receiver here. Um, another thing I like to do is just put him into a hook zone for right now. Um, but you can place him in any zone you like. And then I like to take Casey, either quarterback spy him or just put him into a hook zone depending on if the quarterback is mobile or not. Um, but what you're going to see here is just a nice basic coverage defense. It's going to have uh, pretty good coverage, uh, take away a lot of what people like to do. And um, they're, you know, they're going to have to sit back in the pocket and really make a decision. So that's what we're looking to do from our zone coverage. We'll show you that one more time. Uh, what we like to do, middle plug two, baseline press, spread line, pinch linebackers, the same setup that we've been doing for all our blitzes. Quarterback spy, the nose tackle, take Williamson, put him into a deep third. From there, you can do whatever you want with Huff. Leave him blitzing, or you could man him up on somebody or put him in a zone. It doesn't really matter. And then um, from that point, uh, what I like to do is obviously pass commit and this is our basic zone coverage as you see here uh, it's going to do a nice job of taking away those over the top kind of post routes and things like that and that's really what we're after so you see the defense does a nice job there um, and then the next coverage we want to show you is a man coverage so we're just going to quick audible up to our cover two man from here what we want to do is we want to base align um, and do all of our regular adjustments um, and, and what I like to do here is take this safety and place them in a flat zone. What you'll see is, um, of course, we need to press. If they're in a bunch situation like this, we can actually, um, we, we need to stay baseline and pressed. But what I like to do is place him in a flat zone, um, like so. And then I also like to take Griffin here and normally throw him into a flat zone and take Williamson and put him into a, a deep blue what I like to do is play over the top coverage. This is going to allow those flat zones to get deeper and the deep blue zone to get deeper. And what you'll see here is just a nice coverage defense uh, with a basic four man rush at the, at the quarterback. So we'll show you this one more time, but the play is cover two man, base of line press, pinch linebackers, spread your defensive line. From, from there, take Williamson, place him into a deep third, flat zone, both of these uh, safeties that are in deep blues. And then obviously just go with the over the top coverage is what I normally like to do. And then from here, I actually also, you know, like to, um, you know, do a basic rush here with the four-man line. I can crash them one way or whatever, or I can actually zone them out if I want to, if I deem that important. So what I might do, sometimes I'll just deep blue zone all three of my linebackers um, and then do like an outside coverage technique so that they go a little more to the outside and then of course do all these things like this so all sorts of things you can do but the whole key and purpose is that we're gonna have man coverage now instead of zone and uh, hopefully force them to a triple covered uh, post route like we did there so that's the whole concept but that's our man coverage and our zone coverage look from the big nickel bear um, guys also uh, real quick before I go if you like this type of defense if you like defense the way I like to talk about it then you can check out our full defensive guide in which we show you I think four or five different sets that we go into in and out of to make a really good defense out of the New England Patriots defensive guide so check that out it's pretty inexpensive